varsity who made varsity. Well, at Glen Cove High School on Long Island, a pair of seventh graders have more than earned their share of the spotlight. Once again, here's Lauren Brill. Kayla Hudson. Hudson drops it off. And a pass to Michaela Hernandez. I was watching them play. I'm like, oh my goodness. I, I can't believe it. This is, this is incredible. Kayla Hudson. Off the glass. Oh, boy. How about the seventh grader, Kayla Hudson? That was extremely impressed with their, with their skill level and their love for the game. And that's why Glen Cove's coach Gus Tarakis ultimately brought Michaela Hernandez and Taylor Hudson up to the varsity level as seventh graders. Can you believe two seventh graders starting on a varsity squad? We had the parents support and the, and the girls wanted to do it. I was really excited and I was kind of like hoping for it. When I heard there was going to be two seventh graders on the team, I was like, I got to see what these girls can do. So, uh, the first practice, I was, I was amazed. So I felt really honored to play with a higher level team because being a seventh grader, I feel like I was working towards it. So, I just felt rewarded and excited about it. Yeah, and Michaela, both really going to want to spot up around the perimeter. Oh, over to Michaela from Taylor. Got it. We were best friends since first grade, and um, we're friends on and off the court. We always know what's going on with each other, so it helps with our chemistry. Michaela's good at stealing, fast breaks, and making moves to the basket. She's just a good player. She takes up the point very well. She has nice handles. Here comes Taylor Hudson. All by herself, and we'll lay it in. They, they put the team before themselves. They, they, they came from day one. They, they, they earned their minutes. And they have so much heart for the for sport. They're just like, it makes me proud to be playing with them. They know how to play basketball. They are very good sportsmen. I mean, they are phenomenal. And also, the, the other teammates have, like, welcomed them into the basketball family. And so they became as, like, well as, like, sisters in a family. Taylor is averaging double digits, and Michaela is proving to be a defensive whiz. So it's no wonder they were the first two seventh graders to ever make the Glen Cove girls varsity basketball squad. Michaela to Taylor. Taylor, splash. Some may think it's something in the air, but more likely, it's in the genes. Well, I did very well in basketball. Uh, ended up getting a scholarship to Dallin College. I went and played there. Hernandez on the steal. Took it right away from Vines. And Jason Hernandez. Ended up playing at Hofstra. Two NCAA tournaments there. Played with Speedy Claxton in the backcourt. He's had a big role in my life because I train with him, and he always gives me pointers. And Jason Hernandez, a local guy. I loved going to his games. It was always so fun just to watch him and be there. Taylor and Michaela say they are thrilled to be playing varsity as seventh graders, but as they look to the future, they say they're shooting for even loftier goals. I want to play college ball and maybe pro. I'd like to go to Hofstra University and hopefully get a scholarship. Right now, they are simply enjoying their journey, but their opponents can't say the same. I can't believe it. future sure is bright for this Glen Cove team. One final note on the girls' pedigree. Taylor's grandfather, Alan, was also a top-notch athlete, having fought against Muhammad Ali during his career as a boxer. That's our show, and remember, if you've got a story idea you'd like to share with us, email us at highschooljournal at cablevision.com, and be sure to log on to msgvarsity.com for all the latest on your high school. Thanks to all of you who helped us write another page in the journal. Until next time, I'm Tara Petrolino.